Hey guys, and welcome back to more Miller Shove Mortar. We're going to do a mission, The Power of the Wraith. Queen Marin holds the key to unlock true power of the Ringmaker. The power of the command and domination. Forge an army to challenge the Black Captain. said to bring her an army. We shall not build an army. We shall command one. We'll need to find an Uruk captain to dominate and make our own. There is a slaver near here named Grublik. We will make him serve our cause. So we had to look at Grublik the flogger. Thought we'd quickly grab these items from over here. Here, perfect. Pick that up. There goes another one. So that captain would <laughs> That was probably the easiest one I've ever found. By the white waters of the river Unwe. By the colours so many they burn bright. May none and now look to Marwen, to my gift of second sight. May the elements of earth. Fire, air, form gateway to worlds unseen. Spirits of Valinor, hear my prayer and grant great power new to the shores, Queen. That's longer than a previous one. Should I know? These tribesmen are desperate. They will do anything to resist the Uruks. I fear Lithariel will never surrender. Her honor will doom them all. Up to the forge. You know what happens if the quartermaster's grindstone starts turning? The slaves on the run. Just my imagination. Oh, okay. They didn't see us. Just quickly kill these guys then. Always want a combat brand. The shield bearers are the most powerful, like I had mentioned. Okay, so. So they'll very easily deal with the remainder of them. And the second one is up here. So you can very easily make a small army in these battles, especially if you get a couple stealth brands to begin with. So hard to see in that mode, though that's the only thing. I thought it was somewhere up here, further up. There we go, we're up here now. That's a bit too high. Who's this now? Some unhappy bandit named Forlun or Gorfab or something. He was screaming for his wife. The boys laid into him a bit. Four and a bit. 
He dead? Nah. The boys know the big man powerful living and wants a word. This sack of dog might know where his thief pals are hiding. Strip him down. Take the ring, too, and give it to the boss. He likes that stuff. When he wakes up, Is there nothing these Uruk will not desecrate? For them, beauty exists only to be destroyed. What is the one I need? I do need Mallows. I was just saying, I think it's Mallows I need. Does that Kagrok smell me or...? Yeah, it does. What I can do is go here. And dominate it. Dominating Kegor is a good way to not have to fight a Kegor. So, I think we already know that. How do I dismount? Him. You know it when I start. So now we're again, like I said, building up an army. Oop. You maggot, maggot, maggot. Time to die slow, as slow as a day is long. Die now. So after I'm come. Well, to issue a command. Send your man to murder another captain or become a war chief and bodyguard. I'm not sure if you can combat Bran, a uh, captain. Yeah, see, if you try to combat Bran him, he won't work. Oops. Been waiting for each There you go. Ah, stop attacking them. That's the thing about um, having followers. They're kind of annoying when you're trying to do stuff. Now we're going to fail the mission. <laughs> I'm not sure if there's any way to call off you guys. Maybe if we would have pressed I, I again. More to kill before we isolate the captain. So. That filthy Man filth! I'll cut you open along with any order that gets between us. So this way Let's I don't see which of you bleeds out first. So well, I'm not gonna book Brown as many Urk this time, because that's what kinda caused my problem. Oops. Not exactly who I wanted to. I did want to, so I don't have to deal with this berserker. But. Okay, so we can command him to initiate a fight. So, so it will create a power struggle somewhere in the map. So now you have to actually go to that power struggle and complete it. It is done. He's ours. 
We must now make this captain a bodyguard, if he is ever to be a war chief. It is from First Strike of Thunder that is soon born a storm. So the Paris Jungle, I believe, will just be either to prove he's strong enough to be a bodyguard or um, defeat another orc to become the bodyguard. Either way, you gotta convince him that it's worth it to become. He's worth becoming a bodyguard. Ah, oh, come on. Some of these jump things are a little bit fid fidgety. Bow to your new captain! You lack a captain straight, scum! I must help Rublik eliminate all those who challenge him. So, think... I must help our puppet before they cut his strings. Is he not strong enough to save himself? Because he has a berserker with him. But... Protégé wields fear like a weapon, and we are his invisible ally. A shadow who stays close and sees all. That is the elven way. I don't like the sound of that. Maybe it was just rats. If it's so, stay on guard. Oh yeah, we have to follow Grublik. And this is the part that's annoying. Is you have to kind of oh shit see it's so hard to stay above him in that case because you have to stay on the walls and if you jump off the walls then you're kind of screwed it's really kind of annoying but the game's not really about being above people anyway so if you really want to build up big forces you just keep branding them. Like, watch this one poor guy. He should be ganged up on. Usually that's how they do it. Our captain fights for us well. Through my will, he steers these Uruks of Mordor. Serve my will! No, they're not coming. Oh well. Not to the end of the world. I thought I heard something. Got the berserker ready. Oops. <laughs> didn't didn't realize that was a accidentally hit the instant this sort of after the other one. Oops. Oops. That's my own guys I'm hitting. <laughs> Oop. I didn't know there was an archer. I just clip him and should still kill him. I conquered the weak. Now join me in victory. Any who oppose me will pay with their blood to red swords. Hail our captain! May we die last! We fight for true Uruk! Now that we have our hunter, let us stalk our prey. So, Rubek the Flower was promoted and promoted to bodyguard of all things, so. The war chief has chosen our captain. And he has chosen death. A great advantage will ready us for this battle. And this one is actually, we're very lucky that we actually did death threat him. Because, oops, not this. 
This is one with a death threat already on him. That's not even what I wanted, but... I believe so, yeah. You can see it above his head. That means there's a death threat on him. So... We, we'll get a better rune from him. That's because it's tasty and while it's still beating. Listen to them. Vile savage beasts. And we shall harness and command their savagery. This is a tough stronghold as well. Really well defended. by turning that evil against itself. The Queen is right. We are wise to use the Uruk's ruthlessness against them. And there you go. Here's the vantage point. And who is it behind him? Butter 2 of Bodyguards. We are ready for our final move. Bring light! Can I shell strike from all up here? Oh. oh come on. You maggot! Didn't you say you'd make me big for a merciful death? Found another one? Oop. Man, I'm getting kind of smacked around here a little bit. Come on. I had the execution way before that happened. Now I have a defender myself. That's powerful. Who's shooting at me, by the way? Is he just throwing rocks? There's someone else who's actually shooting at me. Don't think that orc was granted. Well, he was already branded already. Let's see, you have to be really exact with your positioning. Yes, I know I'm attacking my own cap, but I can't find the war chief and pose a kill. Oh, wait, he was available to run. Range towards me. He just lit himself on fire, that one guy. There you go. I believe Tars just lit himself on fire and killed himself. But. Plus, we completed a death threat. And you shall fight for me! This is my dominion! I am the strongest war chief in all of Mordor! I shall lead my army over a field of broken skulls. Come stand behind me, or let my blade beat your neck. Queen Marwyn's plan has given us great strength. Strength should not be squandered, but wielded. The Queen will show us how. Marwyn's strategy yields great results. An army of our own to face darkness head on. A mirror looking upon itself, ready to be cracked. We should return to Marwyn. She will have more for us.
child? Your mother. He's been under the spell of a very powerful wizard. Talion, I am sorry. Saruman brought you here against my will. I went to him for help. I ended up being a prisoner within my own body. What have you seen in your visions? I have seen Sauron's servants, the Tower, and the Black Hand. They bring much suffering. If you wish to know where they are, they are across the Sea of Nunnan. Their forces. How strong? Strong enough to defeat us all. Truly, we will need an army. Illness still plagues you. Rest, Mother. I will make preparations for our journey out of Mordor. So there's mission complete. The power of the wraith. One of the longer missions in the game, but a lot of fun. Saruman is one of the Istari. With the power of the ring, he could have built a great army to challenge the Dark Lord. And that's what we must do. The one garrison does not an army make. Yes. We must dominate more war chiefs for a true army. So we must brand all five war chiefs. Uh, but there's some other missions we can do in the meantime. But anyway, guys, thanks for coming out for more Middle Earth Child Mordor. We'll be back in the next episode for more. Thanks, guys. Later.